You lose consciousness when you are under mm -hmm. the treatment mm -hmm. of uh, general anesthetics. These are small molecules uh, which uh, have been much studied. And we know that the dose of general anesthetics put you asleep. How does it work? There must be some kind of chemistry of consciousness. Mm. And um, the idea, in short, is uh, that um, these general anesthetics are acting on receptors which are analogous to the acetylcholine receptor I just mentioned. But in the case of uh, the acetylcholine receptor, you have the site for the neurotransmitter and the ion channel through which the ion goes through. So it's a chemoelectrical transduction. Now, there are homologues of the uh, nicotinic receptor, like the GABA A receptor. Mm -hmm. So they are uh, a receptor for GABA, uh, which is. Uh, uh, gamma aminobutyric acid, which is an inhibitory neurotransmitter, in the sense that the receptor is linked to a chloride channel and inhibits. While in the case of the nicotinic receptor, there is activation and excitation. Mm -hmm. So inhibition. And now, very interestingly, the finding of uh, ourselves, our group, and other groups as well, is that uh, the general anesthetics are acting on the GABA receptor, not on the GABA site, mm -hmm. not on the ion channel, but on an allosteric site, mm -hmm. which regulates mm -hmm. the transition. That same concept that was discovered in bacteria applied to the brain. And to consciousness. <laughs>